Welcome to our Gemini for Workspace demo. In this video, we'll be looking at Gemini for Workspace, which is a set of AI powered tools designed to enhance your collaboration and productivity across Gmail, Google Drive, Docs, Sheets, Slides, and more. We'll begin by addressing the crucial topic of security, showcasing the robust measures in place to protect your valuable data. Then we'll delve into specific use cases within each Workspace app, illustrating how Gemini can save you time, generate innovative ideas, and take your work to the next level. Before we dive into all of the amazing ways that Gemini for Workspace can transform your work, let's address the most important question. Is my data safe? With Gemini for Workspace, the answer is a resounding yes. Google understands that your data is your most valuable asset, and they've built Gemini with enterprise-grade security in mind. First, your data isn't used to train Gemini's AI models. It stays within your organization's trusted boundaries and adheres to any data sovereignty policies that you've set in Workspace, giving you full control. You can easily manage and customize Gemini's access levels and permissions for your entire team, ensuring the right people have the right access. Gemini seamlessly integrates with your existing data loss prevention policies, helping you prevent sensitive data leaks and maintain compliance. You have full visibility into how Gemini interacts with your data, so you can always know exactly what's happening. You can rest assured that Gemini is designed to make your work easier and more efficient, all while keeping your data secure and private. Now that we've covered the essentials of security, let's explore how Gemini can revolutionize the way that you work across your favorite Google Workspace apps. First, we'll look at Gmail and the Help Me Write tool. We'll compose a new message and ask Gemini to help us with the content. We've been thorough with our prompt, telling Gemini who we are and what we need. If we don't like this response, we can try again. Or refine the content by elaborating on it or shortening it. And of course, once we insert it into our message, we can fine tune it manually as required. But that's not all that you can do with Gemini in Gmail. Show the Gemini side panel by clicking on the Gemini button. You can type in a prompt here or open an email message that you'd like to ask questions about. A short summary is provided automatically. Click on the button to show a longer summary of the entire email thread. You can type in your own prompts too to ask Gemini to generate any content for you based on the email. You can also ask general questions about the emails that you've received. And you can reference specific emails or even documents in Google Drive. Just type the at symbol to reference a document, then type the document name. If you scroll down the side panel, You'll see a button to copy the generated text, which you can then paste into an email or any other location using Control or Command V. As well as using the side panel to find information within Google Workspace, you can find general information on the web too. In summary, in Gmail, you can use Help Me Write to compose email messages and use the side panel to summarize conversations containing multiple messages. You can also use it to generate new content based on these emails. And you can use the side panel for natural language searches and to find information outside of Google Workspace too. You can use Gemini for Workspace to generate content in Docs, Sheets and Slides too. We'll ask Gemini to generate some document text for us, again giving as much detail as possible.
Just like in Gmail, we can refine the content. Or ask Gemini to have another go, if we're not happy with the first result. After inserting the text into our document, we can ask Gemini to refine specific parts of our text too, without recreating it all. And of course, we can add the updated text into our document too. In Google Sheets, Gemini for Workspace can be used to generate tables for any new spreadsheets that you wish to start. Again, put in as much content as possible and tell Gemini exactly what the new table should contain. Sample data is added so that you can get an accurate idea of how the table will work. Once inserted, you can change any of it manually as required. For example, adding new options to drop down lists that were created for you. In Google Slides, you can generate images using Gemini for Workspace by typing a description of the image that you'd like. Any image that you add can be formatted as required once it's been added to the slide. When creating images, you can choose different styles or even add an image to the slide background. Later, we'll be showing you how you can generate entire slides using the side panel too. As you've seen here, as well as in Gmail, Gemini for Workspace can be used to generate content in docs, sheets and slides, but it can do so much more with the introduction of the side panel across Google Workspace. Let's look at the Gemini side panel in more detail now. In Google Drive, you can search for files then drag them onto the side panel to summarise them. A detailed summary is shown that you can expand and copy to include in an email or other documents. In Google Docs, the side panel shows a summary of the current document by default but you can ask for additional content to be created based on this document. You can add this content to your document too by clicking on the Insert button. Before we leave Google Docs, it's worth pointing out the Proofread option too, which will not only check your document for spelling and grammar issues, but will also provide suggestions on other ways to improve your document, such as making your text more concise and making sure the same voice is used throughout. In Google Slides, you can generate entire slides based on content in the current presentation or other documents that you can at mention. You can generate speaker notes too to help you when you're presenting your slide. And insert them into the speaker notes. In Google Sheets, you can use the side panel to ask questions about your data, including any calculations, which can be inserted into your sheet as a formula. You can ask for help with more complex formulas too. And insert the formula into your sheet when it's been suggested. As you can see, the Gemini side panel seamlessly integrates AI assistance into your daily workflow, transforming how you work in docs, sheets and slides. As well as giving you access to Gen AI within your Google Workspace tools, Gemini for Workspace also provides a fully secure AI chat experience that you can use to brainstorm ideas, research web content, and more. As we saw earlier, you can't yet create entire presentations in Google Slides, but you can create your slide outlines here in the Gemini app 
as we'll do now. We can expand on any suggested headings and copy the text so that it can be pasted into our presentation. Gemini for Workspace can be used to draft more formal documents too, such as policies or agreements. These can be added to a Google Doc automatically, which will be created and stored in your own My Drive. You can reference other websites in Gemini too, such as this job role, and ask questions based on that. While Gemini for Workspace can't yet produce images, you can ask it to describe images and diagrams for you in detail. Finally, if you have an image that you want to summarise, you can load it up into Gemini and ask away. When you're using Gemini for Workspace Enterprise, remember that anything that you enter into the Gemini app won't be shared outside of your domain, unlike the consumer versions of Gemini, ChatGPT and other Gen AI tools. Finally, we'll look at the functionality that Gemini for Workspace brings to Google Meet. Just like in Google Slides, you can create images to show as your background in Google Meet. allowing you to change your background to suit the type of meeting that you're attending. On the Appearance tab, Studio Lighting can be used to simulate studio quality lighting allowing you to adjust the brightness and colour of your lighting. Studio Look uses AI to fix issues caused by low light or low quality webcams. This all happens in the cloud so has no impact on performance. If you enable noise cancellation in Google Meet, Studio Sound will automatically improve poor audio quality from typical Bluetooth headsets and dial in participants by using AI to recreate higher audio frequencies. The next feature that we'll show you in Google Meet is only available with the Enterprise Edition of Gemini for Workspace, or the Meet add-on. This is the Take Notes for Me feature, which automatically captures notes from your meeting and pulls out any actions that need to be taken. Notes will be saved in a Google Doc in the My Drive folder of the meeting owner. Notes will be shared with all meeting invitees automatically. As you've seen, Gemini for Workspace is a game changer for businesses looking to enhance collaboration, productivity and creativity. With robust security measures in place, you can confidently embrace AI's power to streamline your workflow and achieve your goals. We'd love to talk to you more about the possibilities of Gemini for Workspace, so please contact us at Ancorus to find out more.